Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and in this video I want to make another relationship spread but now let's analyze a relationship between a mother and her daughter. So as you can see this spread is really good for all kinds of relationships whether it's you and your boss, your partner, you can analyze any relationship that you want. So I shuffled the cards and the, for, the first card that I pull out is this. Then this second, then those cards, and then those cards, and then those cards. This and that. I know it's really messy. So one, two, three, four, five. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So this is the daughter and this is her mother. Let's see how the daughter is behaving in that relationship. So from here we can see that the daughter in this relationship behaves very manly. She is basically behaving like she is the son of that woman. She don't have any qualities of a female. She's very strict, very straightforward, very logical, very not feminine. Here on the mother's side, we have the stars card. And we can see that the mother is pretty much very positive. She is a bit also distant and very light in this relationship because remember that the stars is the card that is representing the skies it's something very far away although it's a very positive card but it might be that the mother is a bit distant and that the mother have wishful thinking maybe to make this relationship better so what is the daughter think about this mother so she thinks that her mother is a sick person that her mother is depressed person and she thinks that her mother is a very closed person not open and it's difficult to even penetrate to her soul to penetrate to the mother's soul the daughter thinks that the mother is very, very distant and close, melancholic, depressed and suffering. So now let's see what the mother is thinking about that daughter. The mother is thinking that the daughter is very, very powerful, very strong person. She also thinks that her daughter can really help her and be very nourishing and to protect even that mother. There is a bit of aggressiveness in the daughter. The mother is thinking also that the daughter is a bit aggressive because notice that here we have a manly, manly card and the mother is thinking that the daughter is very strong and a bit aggressive in her approach. So what is the daughter planning for that relationship? And the daughter is basically not really planning something extraordinary she's planning that this relationship will be stable very family oriented and also a bit territorial she's expecting that her mother know her boundaries what the mother is expecting from that relationship what is she planning maybe she's maybe expecting that the child will be that the daughter will be a bit like a child and she's wanting that their relationship will bring something new also it might be that the mother is really expecting that this daughter of her maybe will have a child so this is also a possibility so how the daughter is acting towards the mother so we have a card of the fox, we can see that the daughter is very cunning, very manipulative, very smart, sharp and 
she is always trying to gain something or to benefit something from that relationship and she is not trusting her mother she's showing that and how the mother is acting the mother is acting like a mother to her we have the moon card this is the card of the mother and the mother is showing that she is a bit not stable she's showing that she has mood swings that she's a bit melancholic. So this is how they act in their relationship. Basically, the daughter is very cunning, manipulative, trying to maybe figure out some things behind the back of the mother, maybe gossiping, we don't know. But the mother is very moody and acting basically like a mother. So what the child, what the daughter is thinking about the mother what is she feeling so we see a very deep feelings towards the mother because the fish card is a very very deep card so she have appreciation and maybe some deep feelings towards her mother it might be sometimes in some cases feelings of material attachments, but it's something that you really need to figure out with your querent. And how the mother is feeling regarding the daughter, the mother is feeling that their relationship is growing, she's feeling that their relationship is very stable, and she's feeling that this is a very family-oriented relationship. So let's see what is bringing them apart. This is the card that is bringing them apart. And we have some distance, some isolation between them. So there is some aspect of each of them putting some guard and they're not really maybe affectionate and close to each other so that might bring them apart and what bring them together this is the cards of conflicts this is the cards of control so we can say that maybe if there are some conflicts in the family this is what actually bring them together if there is something to talk about, to argue about, to maybe clean something in the dynamics of the family, this is actually bringing them together. So this is a very simple spread and you can see that the child is a bit manipulative and the mother is basically acting like a mother and we see that the child is a bit stronger we can see that in this relationship the daughter have stronger personality because the mother view her as the bear card and the bear is the card of power strength and a very powerful personality so already we can say that the daughter have a very very strong personality so basically that's it thank you for watching you can do that spread to any relationship just remember that the middle cards are representing how they behave in the relationship, how they are acting in that relationship, what they're feeling towards each other, I'm sorry, what they're thinking towards each other, what they expect or planning in this relationship, what they're actually, how they're actually acting what they're showing to each other, their feelings, what bringing them apart and what brings them together. So thank you for watching and see you in my next videos.